everyone, it's Dar, and welcome to my channel. I'm just having a little bit of technical difficulties with this um, tripod here. I just wanted to show everybody things that I've been working on while my laptop went out. I have a new laptop and a new disk system, so every video that I made to put on the other one, I can't put on this one because it has to have the little teeny tiny microchip that goes inside of the bigger disc. It's hard to explain, but it's like so small. It's probably half the size of my thumbnail. But anyways, um, this is what I've been working on. I, I know it looks a little different on camera, but this is a, like a hot pink. And this is a multi one. I think it's called Panther Pink. I make these cute little lap blankets because I have a doll channel that I um, interact with dolls and everything and it's it's fun for me it's therapeutic it's also fun for kids to watch anybody can watch from that channel um, this could actually be for real babies or children it's not meant to wrap them up and you know how do you want to say it like bundle them up or anything like that. It's just supposed to go on the lap like when they're in a car seat or on a little um, stroller or something. I'm trying to think. And I have other ones that I'm working on. This I couldn't find until recently when we moved here. But in this house it's a little darker than what I'm used to so it's kind of hard to see unless it's daytime. This is Claret and that is um, I think it's called Autumn or Fall and this is just going to be all in the middle and then this on the two ends. It's not going to be striped like the other one. Now this one is going to be and this is the same thing like the light green I can see very well anytime but the darker I cannot see until it's light out or till my eyes are a little better. But it's frost green and camo print. Now on camera right now, this is actually looking a lot lighter than what it is. But it still looks really pretty. And then I have this one. This one I think is going to be one of my favorites. I know I start a project and then I'm like, oh... I have ideas for other ones, other color combinations. I just learned to crochet a year ago. My mom, when she was alive, she tried to teach me. But it's hard when you're left-handed and you're trying to watch somebody who's right-handed to knit or crochet or any of that. Even to do plastic canvas, I had to learn to do the little stitchings like a, like a right-handed person would. Now this one is a really pretty pink. I think it's um, either carnation pink or petal pink. And this one's called Calypso, and I cannot find it anywhere anymore. So I'm glad I, I got all the scans that I could a, a few years ago. And this one's going to be striped. It's going to be pink, then it's going to have Calypso, then it's going to be pink, Calypso. Or I'll do pink, then ye Calypso, then yellow. Calypso and then purple. Those are the colors that I would use for this. But right now I think I'm going to keep it as pink because it is just a nice contrast against these colors right here. Now I do have one more that's striped like this. And I like the way this turned out. The solid color is Aruba C. And the middle is, um, I think it was called Icelandic or something. And that's a big chunk in the middle with just a little bit of the Aruba Sea on the ends. Oh, that's just really weird. I look at it, for real, it's dark gray, light gray, a light blue, and like a medium to light blue. But on camera it looks like green. The gray does, but... That could just be my eyesight. Well, I do have other videos that I need to try to remake. Um, 
and then I'll get some more of those those videos on and I would like to thank everybody who subscribed to me because while I've been out of the loop I mean I've watched other people's videos I could subscribe I just couldn't upload videos and I could see that people have subscribed to me and I haven't had a chance to say thank you so thank you for subscribing um, please like comment and more subscribers <laughs> bye